With more places to discover reels and Instagram pushing more video, it's really important to include reels in your strategy. I'm Natasha of Shine with Natasha, a video creator and Instagram strategist, and I'm gonna be sharing three tips for better Instagram reels, no pointing or dancing required. Tip number one, start your video with a strong hook. One of the most important elements of a short form video is that hook. And this is the first few seconds of your video that should tell people why they should continue watching. You can communicate your hook in your video in three different ways. It can be written out as text on your video. You can say it directly to camera, or you can say it in a voiceover. Here's a few ideas for engaging Reels hooks. You can ask a question. You can give relatable or entertaining context to a trending audio. You can address a problem directly. You can provide tips, hacks, ideas, or steps. Or you can simply say exactly what the video is sharing, like a day in my life vlog or a tutorial or demonstration on something very specific. My tip for you is to think of this just like a blog title or a newsletter subject line. Number two is to optimize your reel for engagement, including your video length, text, and visuals. When creating your reels, there's three important things to optimize. First, when adding text, make sure that it's easy to read. This means placing your text in the safe zones or in the center of your reel. This ensures that no matter where people are viewing your reel, whether it's on the feed or the reels tab, they can see every part of your text and none of it is cut off. Second is you want to make sure your video is as concise as possible. For trends, I recommend as short as possible, typically under 15 seconds. And other types of reels can be longer, but avoid adding content that absolutely isn't necessary. Use every second wisely. And third, you wanna make sure to keep your reels visually interesting. This could be adding an editing hack like a jump cut. This could be changing clips or even doing a fun transition. And the third tip is to create more original content or what I like to call show and tell reels. While trends are a really great way to create entertaining and quick reels content, it's not the only way to create short form video. I recommend leaning into original content, which is simply using reels as short form video. Here's a few of my favorite ways to leverage original content on reels. Talking to camera where I'm teaching or discussing a topic. Tutorials or demonstrations where I'm visually showing step-by-step -step how to do something. This could have a voiceover on top or just music or even ASMR, which is just sound effects. Or it could be a vlog style video, which is essentially documenting a part of your day, your entire day, or even your week or month. I hope you found these Reels tips helpful. If you're looking for more videos on how to revamp your Instagram strategy, head to my profile. Thanks for watching.